The daily crowd investing market is one of the fastest growing investment directions in the world. If we look at the figures, then knowing that crowd investing got its start in 2005, in 2011 the turnover of this market exceeded 1.5 billion dollars. In 2012 this figure was 2.7 billion dollars. In 2013 it was as much as 5 billion dollars. In other words, the market began to double every year, which showed public interest in this investment area. In 2017, when we started the project Dune of Smarters, the crowd investing market amounted to $34 billion in annual turnover. By 2025, this turnover will have amounted to $300 billion, which means an almost tenfold increase in less than 10 years. By 2030, experts say this market will have been $2 trillion. This means that it will take its secure place in the market of all investment directions, and no serious investor will be able to imagine their investment portfolio without some crowd investing company. And you know, a lot of people are surprised by this. A lot of people do not understand why people invest so actively using the crowd investing method. After all, investment itself was not invented yesterday. People invested 50 and 100 years ago, and even 1000 years ago people thought about how to increase their capital. After all, savings that provide you with a permanent income undoubtedly mean independence, security and confidence in the future. Let's answer the question, why do people prefer crowd investing? Let's take a look at the investment directions known to a lot of people, the so-called classic investments. We will see that there are quite a lot of interesting areas, you may even be an investor in some of them, or you must heard about them at least. This includes real estate, the stock market, precious metals, business investment, and after all currency markets. All of this is quite interesting. But talking to a large number of our investors and partners, I can't help noticing that a lot of people say the same thing. I do not invest in these areas. But I like crowd investing. I participate in your project and maybe in some others. And when I ask why this happens, there are usually two reasons mentioned. Firstly, classic investments are really quite difficult. You need to have a lot of experience, knowledge and high financial literacy. And even if you pass this barrier, you may have a trivial problem of having no money. Because you need quite a large sum of money to buy property or make a portfolio of shares. At the same time, we cannot say that no one invests in these investment areas, because there is really a lot of money in them. Starting to study this issue on a more global scale, we can notice that, in fact, the main investors in these investment areas are not ordinary people, not people like me and you. They are professional investors and major players in the financial market. Banks, investment funds and insurance companies, they are big shots in the investment market. And people have to compete not with each to get access to various promising assets, but with experts. As a result, we come to another problem that not everyone thinks and knows about. All the most attractive assets are held by professional investors. They own the best real estate, shares of the best companies, they invest in the most promising startups that come to them themselves in order to get investment. And believe me, no investment fund will ever offer people to invest in some profitable project if they understand that they can invest money there themselves and make money there themselves. After all, none of us were asked to invest in Google or Apple at the very beginning of their path. Just as we have never been offered, for example, to invest in Zoom, whose shares are now growing like crazy. And we all use Zoom, often replacing real-life communication with Zoom communication. And in fact, these are only a few companies. Such projects and companies are appearing every day. But we learn about it when they are covered in financial magazines, being worth hundreds of millions of dollars, maybe even billions, when they make an IPO. In other words, when all the cream has already been skimmed off by those who learned about these projects in advance. The most interesting thing is that professional investors often do not even use their own money. 
When you give your money to the bank, the bank uses your money. It invests in a variety of investment areas and earns tens and hundreds percent in annual interest. And you are credited a modest 5% of the annual interest, although your money participated in that investment activity. But you know, the world is changing. And today we have a huge number of new technologies coming to us. This is the Internet, these are powerful gadgets and phones, and all of this gives rise to new social technologies that allow people to communicate and interact with each other without any intermediaries. This social technology is crowd investing. Crowd investing is an opportunity to connect a large number of ordinary people, small and medium scale investors, not necessarily even professional investors. On the other hand, there are projects, companies, startups that need money to implement their ideas and their business projects. Here they do not need any intermediaries. And here people can get access to the most profitable assets that were previously not available to them. Today more and more companies are beginning to understand that investing by means of crowd investing is more interesting than just taking money from one large investor. So there are more and more of such requests. On the one hand, such companies understand that if you raise money through crowd investing, first of all, you already understand that your product is needed in the market. After all, if people support it, it means they want to get this product. On the other hand, all those dozens, hundreds of thousands of your investors are your future customers, partners, dealers, and those people who will always support your company. This is very important when you're implementing a really large-scale project.